that suffered a knockout at the hands of Tony Willis in 12, 12 rounds of fight. He was winning until that 12. He wasn't knocked down. They stopped the fight. So he's got an excellent chip. And he's been in with some pretty tough guys now. Jeff Lampkin, good puncher. You Uriah Grant can punch. And of course, Willis, who did not come out, is a very good puncher, who beat him at least by uh, TKO. My son came to the United States because there was no professional fighting in Jordan. Good exchange. Right hand by Hill and Hassan fired right back. Two punch combination. to take its toll. Jab to the body, jab back up to the head. There's another good stiff jab. Seconds round two. See that right hand is strictly window dressing. It sets up the left hook. There's a pretty good right. Hill with a combination. Final seconds round two. Showing that exceptional left hand of his, Eddie Fox, Freddy Roach. Don't give him a chance. That feint, feint ties him up. You catch him with straight punches very easily. Jab and that quick right hand. Right hand and left hook. Straight punches. last round with this combination. He starts with the jab, then he's going to throw, I believe, a couple of left hands, and I think there's a right hand that will follow at the end of it. Well, there's a couple of jabs by Hill. It wasn't a combination. Here we go. I think we're going to see it here. No, nope, same two jabs. In any case, it shows that Hill is getting there with that jab. It's a combination of jabs now. Yeah, that was what it was. Yeah, that's the ticket. Round three, scheduled for 12. Virgil Hill and the Black Trunks won the title in September of 87 with a fourth round knockout of Trinidad's Leslie Stewart in Atlantic City. Stewart had viewed Hill as a one-handed fighter, but it was Hill's right that first hurt Stewart. And then uh, Hill went on to win it with the left. He was thrown down by uh, Hassan. Very strong guy, Hassan. 6'2", 175. We saw Hassan pushing Hill earlier. This time he rocked him to the campus. That's part of what we talked about before the fight, that one of the things Hassan can do is rough him up. But he's doing it from the outside, not the inside, where he can also punch effectively. I'm surprised that Hassan is staying on the outside and he's trying to jab with the jab, but you know, you just don't do that. It's not a good strategy on his part. Well, and not working on the inside hurt Harold Brazier in our first fight as well. Roger Mayweather winning that one in a split decision to retain the super lightweight title, WBC. In an action back foot. And this one picking up here. Midway through the uh, third round. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is an example of when nothing else is happening, pump that left jab, pump it, and you're going to put around in the bank. You're going to sit down, it's in your, in your uh, pocket. There it is again, scoring points. Fighting a smart fight right now, less than a minute remaining round three. Well, you can ask yourself, is he fighting a smart fight or is Hassan fighting a dumb fight? What do you think, Al? <laughs> I think it's the latter, quite frankly, although maybe a little bit of the former because Hill is using his jab well. Could it be a little bit of both? That's possible, too. Where we diplomat. <laughs> Silver medal at the 84 Olympics. Overshadowed by more celebrated uh, teammates. On the same team with Freeland, Big, and Whitaker, Holyfield, and Gonzalez. They did not think Bill would uh, win a medal, but he came through with a silver. Final seconds, round three. WBA light heavyweight. Let's go a little bit out here. Hassan's going to Hey, look. If you go out here and, and work with him, instead of pulling out, when you when you're throwing your punches, you're backing up on him. Come inside. You're, you're safer inside than pulling out. Okay. He hit you with that big hook inside. Besides that, if you go in, he's going to back up. Okay. Okay. Just let your punches go. Let your punches go and follow your punches in. Get inside. You don't want to do one at a time, you want to put all these together. Just like you've been in the gym. Relax nice and relax. You've been in there with the best. Deep breath. Take a big one. Take a big one. There's nobody that works as good as the people that you've been working One more. Rich Wimble to the big cowboy half dose out of it. Round four, scheduled for 12. One jab and jumping back again. He'll be right to the there, it, there it is again, Al. How many times he jabs and back? Has to stay in there. There it is again. My son uh, seems to be posing in front of him. Working on the inside. It's a little late because Mills Lane is in to break him, but that's what his son wants and needs to do in this bout. All right, he had Hill in the corner. He wasn't aggressive at all. He just he just stepped back himself voluntarily, stepped back into the center of the ring. And Hill is a, a big advantage anytime they're in the center of the ring. 